Hello again storage chasers welcome to another video yes we have an empty trailer that we need to fill up we have uh, another unit uh, got to hide in this trailer because it's really windy right now we picked this one up on uh, storage treasures dot com uh, this one cost us hundred and seventy dollars after all applicable fees we paid one seventy five ten this is a five by ten unit and these are some pictures of it. Pictures of it from the door, probably the best one. It's a little windy, so I'm gonna try and hold the paper and so I can show you what it looks like, but this is what the picture shows. This is what it is live and in color. So it looks correct to us, so we're gonna get this one loaded up. We actually have two units of this facility, so I'll be doing two videos at least, if not more. But uh, for now, this is what we got. We'll see you when it's empty. Okay, sorry about the wind. Uh, unit number 083 in the trailer, filled up about half the trailer. Here it is, 083, cleaned out, wall to wall to wall to door, swept clean, better than when we got here. So we got another one to go pick up, but this one is done. All right, storage chasers, we are back at our home base of operations. We have uh, some of the stuff still from this uh, unit in the trailer but we've got all the larger furniture pieces and stuff like that out here and we're going to be going through them as quick as we can because as you can see the sun is getting ready to set over here and we've got to get through this stuff all right uh this is trash from before but we got a shelving unit here pretty decent gonna be uh, able to probably sell that got a uh, wood dresser seems like it's all wood Oops, it's got stuff in the drawers yeah, seems like a might be a handmade one. Uh, the bottom drawer's got some uh, chewed spots on it, but uh, oops, if I can show you in the camera, they got some chewed spots on it. But we'll see what we got there. But uh, let's go through these drawers, blast through it here, see if we can find anything good or anything not. DVD, not in there. Some uh, uh, useless jewelry. Uh, some more useless jewelry. It's a good place to have a shelf. Here's a big glass candle thingy. Whoop, here's another. <laughs> I don't put this kind of stuff in my dressers, but you know, hey. Uh, some bikinis. Oh, this is the woman's, uh, woman's drawer here. As we can see by some of the female attire in there. Found a dime. Found another dime. Woohoo, we're on our way. And uh, found some trash, trash. Found a penny. We're 21 cents ahead. We did pay up for this unit. We paid uh, $170 for this unit. So hopefully we're gonna make our money back. All right, these are pantyhose. No good, no good, no moss. And uh, got some pictures and some trash. These look like uh, bikini stuff. So we will filter through those and see if they're worth cleaning and saving. Big bras, nope, nope, nope. Personal pictures, nope. Um, <laughs> that's something you don't see every day. Yeah, somebody's teeth. I heard that those actually can sell online, but yeah, I'm not gonna play with those. And uh, oh look, here's more. Unless they have gold on them. That is just that is just gross. I found teeth in this unit. All right, um, some night goundy kind of looking material. Feels like it's kind of silky-ish, slipping through my fingers. All right, that is a candle that goes in probably one of these candly things. All right, and uh, and a thermometer that I don't know where they stuck it, so it's in there now. Door number two has a uh, big old picture of. Uh, yeah, that's what it's got. Got a picture. Got a notebook. Got some more women clothes. There's a Rite 80 card. Clothes, 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 and clothes. Go through it more in greater detail. Got to remember we are on the rush level here. Uh, we got some fake flowers. Yeah, there you go if you want them. That's where they're at. And some more clothes. Some more clothes, some more clothes, more clothes, more clothes. So yeah, 
All right, fourth drawer, close, 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 close. Imagine that in a dresser, close. <laughs> Who would have thunk? All right, uh, close, 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 and close. So that one is going to be pretty easy. We're hoping we'll be able to sell the dresser for more than the clothes. Well, last drawer in this dresser. Okay, well, that is interesting. I got to check because the pattern, see if it's a uh, Burberry. And it's not, but all right, close, close, close. There's, there's a hammer <laughs> that's different. Some drugs, nope, empty. Close, close, close. Um, some personal clothes and some more personal. I can keep all the trash in there. Nothing name brand looking, nothing really popping out at me here for the stuff that's in here, but like I said. You know, the dresser is not too super bad chewed up. Somebody will love that for a kid's dresser for the size of it and because it's a good strong strong wood. So found a few interesting things. Found a microwave. Um, it's all taped tape shut right now. I'm not going to mess with it, but we'll clean it up. We'll test it. See what's going on in there. Ah, these are our rags. There is a mirror behind this blankie in here. And we will check that out later because, you know, it's a mirror. If you don't know what a mirror looks like, go look in a mirror and you'll see what it looks like. It looks like you. All right, we got the, uh, let me show you the dresser. Got this dresser, also looks a little bit rough. Uh, we have this one, and we have a uh, matching-ish tall chest one here. And I think the mirror goes with, with this one. And then we have a nightstand that goes with it. And then we have an oddball other nightstand over here so kind of crazy but yeah all right anyway we're gonna go through these drawers and get my my magic trash can over here so that I can trash stuff right away if I need to you never know what's in these things all right drawer number one is a uh, trash trash clothes I don't know what that is, some kind of suntan lotion. Trash, 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 trash. The baseball, not autographs. The makeup and suntan lotions and more junky candle stuff. And uh, you don't want to know. And probably don't want to know. And personal, personal. Downy dryer sheets. We do keep these because we can actually use them in the drawer. Another pen. We're raking in the money. All right. That's drawer number one. Drawer number two doesn't want to open because it's got a bag jammed in there. Probably full of all the gold. All right, we got some clothes. Let me show you what some of the clothes look like. It's got some emblems and things on them here. Uh, Kugi. Kugi is good. I mean, I've sold some Kugi stuff before. Or I have some. I'm trying to sell some Kugi stuff online, I should say. That looks like a vest. Brand new thing. Pencils. Yep, every unit you're going to find some cash, people. And there is a Winchester pocket knife. That is going to be a cool one. I bet you can resell that. And we got some trash. And trash and lock. And some trash and trash. And a, a Steelers. Eh, I just get frustrated. I don't know. We got some drugs. We got a wire, a wire, a wire, a wire. Oop. It's a long one for uh, AT&T one. Sorry, I'm just looking really fast. All right, colored pencils. We're gonna find a lot of colored pencils in the unit. All right, personal, 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 cell phone thing. Another dime, personal. Uh, yeah, hey dad, there's a card. See if they left me any okay we uh, had a camera issue <laughs> but we did finish going through that dresser that is the mirror for it we also went through this dresser here most of the drawers were uh, empty except for some clothes we went through the clothes and most of them are trash so we're not going to go through those again uh, we got a couple of uh, nightstands we're going to go through real quick and then I'll jump back on to the boxes but, uh, uh, as you can see, it's starting to get a little darker out here. Sun's going down. We got things to do. My wife's hounding me, so yeah. 
All right. Get into this drawer. It'll let me. What do we got? We got. We got their drugs. We got their broken phone. We got some personal pictures. We got a uh, one of them. We got one of them. We got some uh, uh, jewelry looking stuff here. I don't know if any of these are any good. Any watches are any good. Oh, am I even showing you all these on the picture? Jeez, my camera works. Sorry. I get into this so much. So, all right, we got some Disney stuff. We got some Nora little makeup per perfumey stuff there. We have a watch, and we have another watch over here that says, oops, there it is, it says I'm a watch, and uh, we got a little thing of uh, batteries, which is really odd, and we got a pencil sharpener, maybe for like their eye makeup pencil, we got a stapler, because everybody needs a stapler in their <coughs> side table, right? All right. Next drawer, oh, there's one drawer, so. All right, what do we got in this one? Uh, well, I can see in the back, we got some, a uh, couple of coinages in there. That's always good to see. And here we've got, uh, bag sounds like pencils. We've got uh, <laughs> ant poison, we've got some personal. We've got some um, junk, 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 junk. Yeah, the ant killer, kind of a weird thing to have in the drawer, but uh, yeah. That's uh, going to be odd. And uh, pencils. Yep, all pencils. So, what we got in here? Is there anything else hiding in there? Nope, just some nail clippers. And looks like some paper clips. And uh, I think that used to go to a drawer. I think that's the drawer runner for the bottom here. Yeah, probably so. So, uh, looks like I'm gonna be doing some more repairs. That's how it looks. We're never fixing more stuff than we get to just sell out right. But anyway, not in bad shape. We'll be able to do something with it. Next one. Uh, it's not gonna open. There we go. All right, let's get in here. It's also got some stuff hiding in there. We don't want it to escape. That looks not like fun. And a shiny rock. Okay, so more pencils and. Uh, let me show you the drawer while I look in here because it looked like personal stuff in this tote. And it is pictures and pictures and baby pictures and pictures and pictures. And uh, yeah, I feel bad because there's a lot of baby pictures and stuff. But this was another facility that we went to that they did not want us to drop off any of the junk to them. They didn't want to be responsible for getting it back to the people. So. They, they're tired of the people, they didn't pay, so they don't want to see them again. I've got pens and paper and pens and pens and I'm afraid to look. It looks like a little camera, camera in the bag. That might be something worth uh, taking into farther. A couple of coins and uh, yeah, that's what's in the drawer number one. And I didn't put it in right. I can feel it. All right, there we go. Drawer number two. Dun dun dun. All right, more junk in the trunk in the back. I don't know if we can see it. Coinages, bunch of coins, coins. Yep. Just get all the coins, throw them. We do have a Bible. Um, of course, you know if it's personalized or anything, we don't want to uh, to. You know, give away somebody else's personal stuff, so we'll take out anything that's personal in there. We do not rip pages out of the Bible, but uh, we do um, give away the Bibles at our flea market table because God's Word is free and needs to be that way. And, uh, um, yeah, it's just for sore muscles. That's what it is. And uh, we got some more coins and more pins and a couple of... Uh, CD cases, no CDs in there. Ooh, look, Domino's Pizza Tracker. Mm. And some more coins. Some more coins, and some here, and uh, one of the other yeah, thing, and uh, yeah, some some weird thing here, and uh, some more weird stuff here, more weird stuff here. I always see these little jars of stuff. I don't know what they're for, but 
Uh, Paris Hilton something. So I guess it's little smellies or something. Here's some nasty candy. And uh, yeah, that's what is in the drawer. Now on to some boxes because we are really running out of daylight here. All right, this one says uh, Barbie's Eve stuff. Oh wow, that uh, this could be good, huh? Um, here's a, a, a gymnastic Barbie. I don't know. I think it's no, it has a barcode on it. 1995. And here's another Barbie that. The box is tore up, but it's class of 2002, so I'm guessing it's about a 2002 Barbie. Huh, I didn't even think it'd be weird. So, there's those nice boxes open here uh, Hollywood Legend, Scarlett O'Hara, Velcro. Oh, it's Velcro. I <laughs> did not want to tear it. But uh, yeah, here's a Gone with the Wind, Scarlett O'Hara. Barbie in a goldish kind of box. The box is, you know, not too bad. It's a little dusty, dirty. Uh, it also does have a barcode on it, so that tells me it's not super duper deluxe old. Here is a VHS of Scarlet and Beyond. Jessica Lang. VHS. Here's another one of these. Here's another Barbie Scarlet O'Hara. Wasn't the first one Scarlet O'Hara? Oh, she's wearing something different here. Here's a Scarlet O'Hara wearing a white dress. All right, here's box number three, and it is Scarlet O'Hara, and she is wearing a red dress. Dun dun dun, or purple. It's kind of a burgundy. Sorry, it's a burgundy-ish dress. All right, one more box. Well, who do you think it is? <sighs> yes, it is Scarlet O'Hara, and. She's wearing a big green dress. Looks like the one of the witches from the Wizard of Oz. <laughs> uh, yes, okay. And so we got that. And then there's a, a board in here or some sort. It's laying in there. I don't know what it is. So I'm not going to... I don't want to mess with it too much. All right, let me get all these Barbies back lined up in the box here. Because that... I mean, I don't know much about Barbies, but I know people collect them. So if I can collect them safely, other than the box damage here, maybe somebody will still want that. I don't know. VHS, maybe that'll sell for somebody that wants it too. But that's kind of cool. Yeah. All right. And then uh, we got this one here. It says Kitchen Breakable. Slam it around. It says it's breakable. And that is ugly metal. Uh, that pot's in better days. Crock pot. There is a crock pot with lid. Ooh, that will sell. There's some pie pans and stuff like that. Another cup. Individual little personalized size little coffee maker. We might clean that up and try and sell it. Here's another pot that has seen better days. And it's not a name brand one, so. That'll go to metal scrap. That'll go metal scrap. Uh, yeah. All these have seen better days and go right to metal scrap. Because I ain't gonna mess with them. The crock pot and maybe the coffee pot we will try to save because those might actually sell at the flea market. Yes, that'll be good. Okay, so. That side is done, and these are done. So we found uh, one interesting box with some Barbies. That was unexpected. Let's keep going because, you know, we like to find cool stuff. And I do have a knife. You saw me find it in the first part of the day. This, but you know, sometimes ripping open stuff makes you feel better just to tear stuff apart. This says, oh, it says breakable also, so. Pretty sure we slammed this one around, getting on and off the truck trailer. All right, what do we got? We've got uh, certified international Nancy Green. No idea. Then we've got some clothes, which are probably nothing good. There's another certified Nancy Green 
uh, some kind of tray with the same kind of flowery pattern. This probably goes with it. And then we got some personal stuff, so everybody look away. Oh, hold on. Coca-Cola Life. That is kind of cute. It's a little green. Coca-Cola, if I have it in the camera, it'll probably be better. It does have a barcode on, so it's not that old, but it's a baby can. All right, we have a Sweetwater Going Coastal IPA with pineapple. It, it's actually got something in it, so I'm pretty sure I can't sell that, right? Pineapple flavored. I don't know. I got to see if it's got alcohol in it. Here's another one here. Uh, maybe they're collectible. I don't know. Here's a little jar of sand and shells from the shores of St. Augusta, Florida. Uh, probably one of the little gimmicky things. Here's a little baby candle. Cinnamon vanilla. Alrighty. And here's a little one of them thingies. <laughs> I was looking for one of them. Alright, here's an angel. Yeah, not as beautiful as my angel, but she's pretty good. And here is one of them uh, collectory bottles. We do sell these at the flea market. I think uh, online they sell for like eight bucks. Flea market, three bucks maybe. Alright, here's a really heavy. That's got a hole in it like for a candle holder thing, but I'm trying to see. They were, somebody was trying to sell for two dollars. I'm telling you, that is, that is really heavy. Whew, that's a monstrous piece. All right, there's uh, another picture frame with some personal. And uh, here's another bottle. So I got uh, two of those big bottles. And I got a shell that says Hawaii. And uh, yeah, we got some uh, red candles. We got some more towels. And uh, here's, oop, that's got something in it. Better not break that. All right, here's an, oh, another one of them heavy crystal-y things. I got a pair of them now. Got a pair of crystal -y things. This one here's wrapped up and probably breakable. Ooh, that is kind of cool. I only had it for $2.99. Huh? We'll just have some scratches on it. But that's just a unique shape. I like it. Probably won't keep it, but I like it, <laughs> which means it may make me some money. All right, we got a little container here with uh, artificial satellites. I guess it's fireworks. I don't know. It's kind of what it looks like, but oh, there it is. There's the top to it. It's a purse. Oh, it's a little porcelain or ceramic -y purse. Kind of cute. We've got CDs. Some, some real, some burnt. Gonna have to go through all these because we don't know. And we've got another fan. And we got some electrical plugs here with some weird lights of some sort and another candle and uh, looks like we're gonna get into some personal and some personal and some personal that's a it's a weird shoe okay here's some of the moldy shoes here's that shoe there's another one of them sounds like money What's in here? We got a we got a Jordan box. That sounds empty. Why are we waste space with that? And yeah. All right. Here's another box and another picture. No, oh, not a picture frame. It is a desktop bean bag toss game, and it actually feels like it's in there. Why is this bag fighting me? There you go. Okay. So. Bean bag toss game. Probably get them at Walmart or Big Lots or something. Don't need it. The Bates bar. Oh, there we go. Now we're talking. Xbox 360 games. Well, I, I got boxes. Nope, there are games in there. All right. I don't know if game if the 360 is as good as popular. I mean, as uh, some of the other ones. But wow, I mean, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 12 games, and a couple of uh, birthday cards here we'll go through. That is really kind of cool. I like that. Okay, I got the little tin open, and there's uh, just a bunch of nickels in there. Don't think there's anything special about them, but, you know, it's something. So we got some nickels, and uh, got some 409 coming at us. 
Uh, this one looks interesting. It uh, says Xbox on it, which would be good because we just got that other shoebox that had games in it, right? So, hold on. Got the cardboard box in half. Huh, cool knife though. All right. What do we got? We got a we got a box. It's a Xbox 360. It's really heavy too. Wow. Never had an Xbox 360, so I don't know, but it, that one seems heavy. And it's got a it's got a Microsoft box here, and it's got a oops, there's a controllery thingy here, and a wire and a plug. All good stuff, right? And then we got like a little desk organizer thingy here, and it's got junk mail and junk mail and a candle and junk mail, junk mail, phone book, junk mail, junk mail. So yeah, that's what we got. Some more pins in there, and uh, yeah, that's gonna do it for this box. Okay, on to the next box here. This one says glasses uh, breakable. We love glasses breakable. We do, we do, we do. All right. Um, there's a funny pillow, and here's a funny pillow. Here are some black mainstay bowls, just ceramic black bowls, not glass. And uh, there's another one. And uh, well, these ones got a couple of chips on this one. But there's four. And there's a clear glass one, another black one. Make five. And here's another glass one that's an uh, Anchor Hawking Mixing Bowl. And uh, oops, let me get in here so we can see. Here is a measuring cup. Interesting, we do like those. Here are some more glass plates. There's three of them. They're square-ish. Kind of interesting. All right. Here are some black plates to match those black bowls. So we're getting towards a set now, aren't we? Here we go. Summer's be big coffee glass. Nope, just regular glass. Here's another little glass. Kind of heavy-duty glass. Here's another one down here. Uh, Bud Light, New York, Yankees this maybe or something. I think it came out of the same bunch. So there's glasses in there. I really don't want to break them. Don't want to bore you guys either. So we'll move on to uh, the next boxes here. We've got a box of the lid of junk. And uh, yeah, we'll throw that to the side because I like this stuff. All right, we got some DVD boxes. No other games, it doesn't look like. Got some movies, and we got some books. Books don't really sell at the flea market too much, but if the movies are in the boxes, they do, however, sell. So we will look at those, kind of scan through the books here and see if anything look, jumps out at anybody, but I doubt it. If you want it, it'll probably be gone before you guys can let me know that you want it. Okay, here is another homemade quilt. Don't know if that's the color it's supposed to be or if it's faded, but homemade ones do sell. This one is, as well, looks homemade. Looks homemade. But now uh, the pattern looks like it's done by a machine and it's got a burn hole in it. So this one, unfortunately, will be trash. This one looks to be homemade as well. That's very cool. Here's a big plastic bag, and more surprisingly, more dishes, Ugh. and an ashtray, and here's some coffee mugs to go with the black coffee dishes that we found in the other one, and this one is smelling pretty rough, what's in here, we'll go through that and let's we'll check it for other stuff, some other cups and cups. Happy birthday cup, a couple other little like uh, wine glass cups or something. Yeah, the ashtray's got to go. And what's in this box here? Of course, we get these. This should almost be in my top ten of things we buy in the store. Today. And and I can only sell these for about five bucks at the flea market. And even with all the little combs it's got, I mean, they're nice and all, but not everybody wants them. And then, uh, oh, here's another one of them black ones for that set. Um, 
Maybe it's electric, rechargeable. Oh, here it is. Here's a rechargeable. Uh, I think that's a men's trimmer, beard trimmer thingy or something. We'll try it out and see if it works. We can sell it. We can try to sell it anyway. Uh, I don't know what this is. Some kind of high tech flosser or something. I don't know. We'll figure it out. And then that, and then that, and then that, and then powder that spilled everywhere. Let's see if it smell funny. And then that is it. That is it for that coat. Whoo! So, this is going to be it for video, uh, whatever I'm going to call it. And this will be part one of probably three parts, unfortunately. But I tried to get all the big stuff, the uh, dressers and other stuff like that, in this first part of the uh, first video. So I don't have to hassle with it again and we can clean them up and uh, hopefully post them and get them sold or on their way to being, you know, put in a new home. But uh, yeah, a couple of little quilts here, interesting things. We've got some DVDs, got some uh, interesting little dishes. We got a box of trash, we got another box of trash, got some other trash, got some Barbies. We got some video games, we got a video game system. And this is only part one. I mean, we're doing pretty good here. And some change. So, uh, as always, please like, share, subscribe, comment, all of that fun stuff for us. Let us know what we're doing good, what we're doing bad. If there's uh, something that you want to see more of, less of, um, let me know. And uh, as always, we will talk to you later.